Welcome back everyone, Dino Joe here. I just finished up repairing the 661 cylinder. This one I had came off of a part saw. Cylinder was good, the bore was good. I ported it up, dyno tested it, made good power, but I wasn't going to let it out with the messed up bolt hole. So I decided I might as well take the time, fix it right. In this video I'll show you how I did it. Alright, here we have messed up 661 cylinder. Well, it looks like originally the muffler bolt busted off. They tried to get it out, tried to get it out, messed it up, put the wrong bolt in, you know, loosened up, loosened up. So during all that, the muffler came loose, pounded this flange. So this flange is messed up. This hole was all messed up. I went bigger, had some aluminum threaded rod so i tapped this made a plug what i'm going to do is i'll put the plug in tighten the plug down and then i'm going to weld up this flange i'll remachine it redrill and tap this hole the 661s, they have clearance on close to the flange, and then the threads are actually down in the bottom. So we'll do the same thing over here. This is underneath the surface a little bit. I'll take this up and get rid of these spots, resurface that, and it should be good to go. Fire up the welder, see if I remember how to TIG. Get some fresh ground tungsten in there. You're a welder i've been using the purple band i think it's a tri mix it's been treating me pretty well but i'm still pretty new at all this tig stuff get our filler rod trim it down a little bit i'm gonna switch to ac About 125 amps. Now we go 130. Let me try that. Now with the AC current, it goes both ways through the metal. So it'll go in and it'll come back out. And when it comes back out, it'll pull all the impurities to the top. Cleaned it off pretty well, but it is a casting. Castings do weld ugly. It's been a while since I've done any TIG aluminum. So this may be ugly, but we'll see what happens. Oh yeah, it's ugly. Not super pretty, but The low spots are now high spots. We can machine that off and drill and tap that hole and it should be good to go back into service.
That'll work there. Now we'll locate and drill and tap the other hole. All right, let's get the hole drilled in it now. That's the tap drill size. No, we'll do the clearance drill. The clearance drill, this just goes in the quarter inch or so. Just like so. All right, we're getting somewhere. Just need to tap it smooth out the inside and I'll be ready to go. If you want to see more repairs like these, leave a comment. Let me know. If this is your type of video, hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe so you can see more. Thanks a lot, everybody. Well, here's the finished repair. Nice machine surface. Just have one little pour over here, but that's well out of the gasket ceiling area. Everything blended in nice. Tap nice. So this should bolt on like a stock muffler again. It'll be going on this 661. Just picked this up. This is a bone stock, late 2014 model. So I'll get some baseline runs of this. Put on this ported cylinder. Let me know what you think.